So it's not very long, um, 2 Corinthians. If you have the time, I would encourage you to read it. But do bear in mind this backstory that's going on. He writes this letter to um, assure them of his love and commitment to them, to encourage them that as part of their repentance, they need to fully repent and they need to see through their financial commitments, which we'll come to next month. Uh, It's later in the book. And also he writes to teach them and to challenge the rebellious minority who still under the influence of these other leaders are continuing to reject Paul and his gospel. All of that informs 2 Corinthians, the background to 2 Corinthians. Um, and that would explain why, as you, if you read it through as a whole book, you will notice that there are some quite sudden shifts in tone and focus. It's good to know the background. It's good to know. Um, But despite all the emotional stuff that's going on and the explaining that Paul is doing, there are still some beautiful and rich passages in this book that where Paul just expounds um, his uh, ideas about Jesus, about the cross, about suffering, about endurance and repentance and the transforming power of the Holy Spirit. And it includes some really familiar poetic phrases. Um, if, if I was, um, was I, when I read through this, I, I just pick, I, re, I read through the whole book in about um, half an hour, three quarters of an hour, and I just picked up a certain number of. I thought, oh, that's here. Oh, that's here. And there's a certain number of verses which I mean, I might I might have called them Paul's greatest hits, to be honest. Um, we are the aroma of Christ. You've heard that before. Where the spirit of the Lord. We've just sung this this morning. Where the spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom. We who with unveiled faces beholding the glory of the Lord are being transformed from one degree of glory to another. We carry this treasure in jars of clay. And a personal favorite, we walk by faith and not by sight. And I know that one because I learned a kid's song about it many years ago. And it has some brilliant actions. And I walk by faith, not by sight. Anyway, 